Hey, Tim DeStasio here, and it is Psychrometric Saturday again. We've been talking about sensible heat, dry bulb temperature. We've talked about how it is the x-axis, where these tick marks go from a left to right, and the lines go straight up and down. Now we're gonna be talking about moisture over the next few episodes because air has moisture in it. That moisture has heat, it has other properties that we need to be aware of. So just like if there is more moisture in this container here, then I'm gonna see that in the higher level in the container. The same thing with the psychrometric chart. Think about it like this container. The more moisture we have in the air, the higher we're gonna be in this chart here. So moisture is read in several different ways, but today we're gonna to talk about absolute humidity. That's different from relative humidity. You're probably more familiar with that. We'll talk about relative humidity at another time. But absolute humidity measures how much moisture is absolutely in the air. It's not contingent on any other factor like temperature of the air. It is literally how much moisture is in the air. Now, with this chart, you can read absolute humidity on the left side of the chart. You can also read it on the right side of the chart. On the left side of the chart, we read it in the form of dew point, and that unit of measurement is degree Fahrenheit. We're gonna come back to dew point. On the right side of the chart, we've got what we call humidity ratio, and that's measured in grains per pound. Now, I don't know about you, but I've never heard of a grain of moisture. So just to put it in a little bit of context, this is a pint of water, and there are 7,000 grains in a pint of water. Well, if that still doesn't make a lot of sense to you, you're not alone. Don't worry about that. Uh, and really, there's only one or two formulas in psychrometrics that we really have to worry about grains. When we're talking about moisture in the air, I want you to be thinking about dew point. When you're thinking about how humid it is, I want you to think about that in terms of dew point. And we'll talk about dew point next time. For now, thank you for watching. It's Psychrometric Saturday. Have a great day.